Okay, finally, let's go through a few stretches that you can do after a swim session, after a session like this, which will really help improve um, your flexibility, your range of motion, and make sure that everything's still moving quite soft. So, um, fav favorite uh, pose from quite a few people um, is, the, is the, the lap stretch going from a child's pose. Uh, so you're going to go into a nice child's pose position onto your knees, you're going to stretch your hands forwards, and you're going to just lean back. You should feel that stretch coming through your lat. However, you can make that a little better by moving over to one side like this. And again, really feeling that down your sides just here. And then moving back to the middle. And then moving back over this way here. And getting that stretch coming down into that position. With these sort of stretches, you want to look to hold them for a longer time. That might be 30 seconds to a minute, five, seven, eight, nine breaths, depending how uh, comfortable you feel with these ones. Just feel free to really just put, kind of relax into that position as well. As swimmers, you really want to take use of doorways or windows. So I've got this wonderful window just here. We've got a few different stretches we can do. We can look at doing a stretch which works on the pectoral muscles. So I'm actually going to take my hand in that position. I'm going to rest it against the doorway. And then I'm going to rotate my body away from it and push through my shoulder and almost through that doorway there. Stretching around the front of my chest here through my pecs. Nice stretch into that position just there. You can do exactly the same one as well, by instead of having your, your sh shoulder in that position there, bring your hands to your side. And then, again, same idea, drive that hip through, keep the elbow nice and connected, and you're always pushing through that way. It just opens up things a little bit more as we go around through the stretch. Again, longer time of stretching um, for this one. Uh, you can do some fantastic stuff if you take a band, uh, for example, you can be having a big band or otherwise, again, rotating all the way through into this position just there, feeling the stretch on either side. You can also do some band work rotating all the way through like this, and then as you get closer, move the hands in, and again, keep on rotating that shoulder around, and you should find that as you get more and more flexible, you can get closer and closer and closer in as you bring your hands together. Again, helping to improve some of that streamlining position as you go through. You can take advantage of your tricep stretches. So you've got the classic one across your chest like this. Again, pushing through the elbow, rotating this shoulder, if you like, towards the elbow. And you should feel the stretch down the outside of your arm. Or, or from the top, pushing down, down your back, so you're pushing that way into that position. And again, from this position, you should feel the stretch going through your, your tricep and also more of your, uh, your shoulder muscles as well. You can also, though, take advantage of more walls, etc. So here, I might put my hand back of the hand against the wall. I'm then going to put my elbow there as well. And I'm going to bring this elbow towards my shoulder and look away at my other shoulder here. This is a great stretch to really work into your um, shoulder rotator cuff and the deltoids. And you can do a similar sort of thing, but just turn the hand around like that and it gets the stretch a little bit more in underneath your arm and your shoulder and into that front there. So you've got the two, one here like this, bringing that hand in, uh, the shoulder in towards the elbow. Or, same idea, the hand's going to be facing there. And again, moving into that position there, trying to push that elbow and the, the shoulder in together as you go around. Both of those are excellent ways to open up that stretch um, in the shoulder area. These are a few exercises, or stretches rather, to help you with some mobility work. Um, clearly that's some stuff that's been working on this year, but they can absolutely take place after any swim session or your own stretching routine as you finish off as well.